This video app review is brought to you by the iPhoneAppReview.com. What's up, everybody? This is Luke Patrick with the iPhoneAppReview.com. We're slinging out yet another iPhone video review today, this time looking at a uh, rather innovative and unique app for the iPhone platform, and the uh, app in question is called 3D Solar System. Uh, but before we dive into that, it actually requires a little bit of extra hardware, which is the thing I've got in my left hand right here. This is a Hasbro My 3D Viewer which uh, is compatible with either the iPhone or the iPod Touch, which is what we've got right here. And uh, you are going to, you're going to need this uh, to actually use 3D Solar System, and it's not that big of a hassle. We found this one at Target for about 20 bucks, and it opens up a lot of new potential for the iPhone. It's kind of a unique uh, example of what can be accomplished with this device. Uh, and we're really uh, kind of overwhelmed with how cool it is. We didn't expect that, and to be honest, it's a really neat uh, function. Like we said, this can be par purchased for about 20 bucks. And uh, it comes with a variety of cases to match any generation of hardware. Uh, you simply open this, uh, slide your iPhone or iPod into the uh, holster, and then snap it shut and then view it as you would, say, those old uh, you know, image viewers from your childhood. So it's quick, it's simple, and you're going to need it to uh, actually use this app. And uh, with that in mind, that's all we have to say. We just wanted to show you this really quick before we dive into the uh, actual application itself. So, with that in mind, we're going to jump to the dark room now. Alright, and welcome back everybody. We are looking at 3D Solar System. Now we're going to actually look at the, um, the actual app itself as opposed to the hardware which we covered just a second ago, showing you what you're going to need to actually enjoy this experience. And the reason you're going to need that hardware is because, if you've noticed, uh, this is split two different ways. This side is mapped to the right half of this app, while this side is mapped to the left half. And when you combine the 3D viewer, they are uh, conjoined to form a single 3D experience. Sadly, we couldn't figure out a way to show you that uh, via the actual Hasbro My 3D Viewer, because we couldn't figure out a way to, uh, way to get the camera involved with that. However, we can show you the application. Just keep in mind that the split view is conjoined when you actually have the viewer. With that being said, we are going to tap and get this thing launched and show you just a little bit of the smooth functionality that this uh, app has to offer. So right off the bat, you see the sun there, and uh, tilting this in and around, you can see all of the universe around you, which is an extremely cool feature, especially with the Hasbro My 3D Viewer involved. This is, of course, 3D and very, very interactive. You can look around, you can see some planets off in the distance there. And uh, so let's say you've got, uh, you want to get a little bit closer look at the sun. Obviously, there's a thrust button on the side here, and again, when these are conjoined, you only see one set of each of these buttons. So we're going to tap here just to thrust a little bit, uh, flying closer to the sun, as you can see. And you can just kind of smooth over and go into the uh, side orbit here. And whenever you're ready to stop, simply hit stop. And uh, there you go. Which is really cool. We vastly enjoy this experience. It makes it feel like you have your own spaceship. Uh, not to mention the fact that by holding down the thrust button and uh, selecting solar system objects, you can then scroll through and select any other object in the area that you enjoy. Uh, so let's go to our dear old Earth, and then off it shoots, uh, which is extremely cool, especially in the 3D experience. Uh, the textures themselves look great. This reminds us of a couple of different solar system apps currently available for the Mac desktop. Um, and the, uh, as we mentioned, the, the graphics are absolutely fantastic. Likewise, the interface is extremely simple. If you want more information about a planet or object, simply hold the left side on the, uh, the stop function, and then you get a little uh, brief introduction to the object, uh, some basics, um, basic uh, you know, data points about it, as well as a brief description. Uh, you can then hit this if you want to see more, or exit out anytime you want. There's a whole heap of objects available. Obviously, these are all kept to our solar system, but then again, we can't blame them for not expanding. The universe is a big place. Uh, we did, in fact, uh, enjoy the, uh, the inclusion of the moons. Uh, we thought that was great. And uh, we also like the fact that Pluto is here, though we are slightly sad that it's not considered an entire planet. But hey, that wasn't their decision. So all in all, we very much, uh, very much enjoyed the flying experience that this app has to offer, as well as the educational value. If, uh, if you're in the market for uh, educating children, or yourself even, adults, uh, this is a great way to do it and a very visual way to do it as well. It makes it extremely easy to learn more about the solar system and in an extremely interactive way. Especially with the Hasbro My3D Viewer, it looks fantastic and the 3D experience is not to be missed. There is also one other thing we'd like to show you. Uh, if you hold down the thrust button again, you can get a uh, brief description of the size of the planets. To do so, you simply click down and hit OK, and then it blares through this uh, sort of slideshow-ish uh, uh, thing showing you exactly how big the planets are, and if you were unaware, they're rather large. So it just kind of puts into perspective what you're actually looking at through the viewer. We really like this, and it's a great educational value on top of everything else.
So at the end of the day, we really enjoyed what the 3D Solar System has to offer. Uh, and so much so, in fact, that we're going to give it a very rare for us 5 out of 5 star rating. It's a great app, and it really shows the potential of the iPhone, not to mention the educational value of the iOS platform. So that's a 5 out of 5 star rating for 3D star, or, uh, Solar System, excuse us, 3D Solar System. That's all we have to say about it. We really enjoyed this app, and we hope you will, too. It's a lot of fun, and we hope you'll check it out. That's all we have to say, so I'm Luke Patrick reviewing for the iPhoneAppReview.com, and I just want to thank you guys for tuning in. As usual, you can check out the rest of our videos on the YouTube channel. If you want to hear my voice, that is the place to go. Or you can go to the iPhoneAppReview.com for heaps of our written reviews as well. We're posting new content to both places with some frequency, so check back often. In the meantime, we're going to be signing out, so we'll see you guys later. Bye.